Alright Titans, look, since for some reason you seem to have a problem trying to win football games, I'm going to teach you how to learn to win football games. Alright, look, I made a pie graph here of steps one through four, and I'm going to share them with you. Alright, follow along. How to win Titans. This is how you do it. Look, one, run the ball. It's simple. That's the name of the game. That's how you're going to score points. you got to run the ball. If you want to make progress, you got to run the ball. I mean, seriously. I mean, but Malarkey, you give Derrick Henry four carries? I mean, you ain't going to win a football game when Derrick Henry gets four carries. I mean, that's ridiculous. The guy needs like 40 minimum even to get going. I mean, we would dominate. We would destroy him. Roll tight. Anyway, step two. Pass the ball. Preferably to the person that's open. That's the one with the highest likelihood that's going to catch the ball and score touchdowns. Maybe move the ball forward, move the chains as the kids say. But listen, that's how you're going to do it. When you throw it to the person that has two or three people on it, that decreases the likelihood chances that you're going to catch the ball. I mean, come on. It's simple science. I mean, you should bring. I mean, actually it's math, but I mean, it's all the same. You get it, you know, it's stuff you learn in school. I mean, come on. Anyway, look, three, score, touchdowns. I mean, seriously, that's the only way you're going to win the game. You ain't going to do it by kicking field goals. Why are you going to settle for three when you can get six? I mean, don't kick field goals. Always score touchdowns. I mean, unless you have to kick a field goal. If you have to kick a field goal, then do it. But just make sure you get one or the other, you know? One or the other. You get my point? My point about the points? You get it? The point? That's a joke. Anyway, look. All right. Never mind. Four. Don't let the other team score touchdowns. I mean, seriously, it's simple. I mean, the Dolphins, I mean, come on, it's pitiful. The Dolphins, their mascot is stupid. It's a fish. I mean, yeah, it's cute and it helps people, but I mean, and there was a show where one talked, but I mean, other than that, they're stupid. I mean, they ain't been good since Ray Finkel. I mean, come on now, seriously. And Jay Cutler, don't even get me started. Jay Cutler, we lost to Jay Cutler. I mean, and to top it all off, I just seen a video where a Dolphins coach was doing cocaine right before he went to a meeting. You mean to tell me that the Tennessee Titans lost to a team where the coaching staff is on cocaine? I mean, they doing cocaine for meetings? I mean, that's just crazy. But I mean, seriously though, I mean, that's crazy. That's crazy that that coach was doing cocaine right before he went to a meeting. I mean, I mean, don't you think somebody probably knew, like, some of the other coaches were like, hey, you know, Coach Forrester's like really excited to be here today. I mean, did he drink a bunch of coffee? I mean, what's going on? I mean, anyway, you know, back to a point. But listen, you got to get your stuff together, tighten up. Come on, that's how we're going to do it. We got to tighten up as a unit. Come on, guys. Still with you. Best team ever. Greatest team ever. But I swear, if you don't get your stuff together, I might start getting a little frustrated. I mean, and Mariota, get your butt back out on the field, man. You're like a glass man. You keep getting broken. I mean, seriously, we paid a lot of money for you. I mean, come on. Tighten up.